World Heavyweight Championship bout. And here comes the champion, Ric Flair, working his way through the mass of the crowd here at the State Fair Coliseum in Dallas, Texas, where Ric Flair will defend his championship against another Ron Eric, this time Kevin Ron Eric, the American Heavyweight Champion. You may recall that Flair has twice defended his championship against Kerry Von Erich. Twice he has been successful, though it is still in the minds of many of the fans, most of the fans, that Kerry Von Erich is still the uncrowned heavyweight champion of the world. And there he is, Rick Flair, and here comes the challenger. of that tremendous plan of Von Erich's Kevin, David, Gary, and of course, in that rank of immortality, their father, Fritz Von Erich. As Kevin tries to, probably has a much trouble getting through this crowd, is getting to the ring and in against Rick Flair. Here he comes. And there is the great world champion. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight here at State Fair Coliseum, the National Wrestling Alliance's World Heavyweight title is on the line. First, in the white tights, from Denton County, Texas, 235 pounds, Kevin Bonner. His opponent tonight, defending his World Heavyweight belt from Minneapolis, Minnesota, Nature Boy, Rick Flair. 232 pounds, one fall about 60 minutes of time limit. Bronco to your referee. And so, Anand, the world heavyweight champion, is facing a Von Eric. And tonight, it is Kevin Von Eric who holds the American crown and who holds the reputation of the Von Eric family in his grasp as he goes against a young man from Minnesota who has gained. Tremendous reputation as a champion. One of the most, there's the World Heavyweight Champion belt. The prestigious belt of the World Champion. Flair, something of a peacock, something of a strutter, certainly not as much of a strutter as gorgeous Jimmy Garvin, but he's very sure of himself as a champion must be. And Kevin Von Erich, you notice he's barefoot, he works better, he says that way. Great move by Kevin Von Erich going into a head scissors. Well, this match long expected, long anticipated. Sliding out very nicely of that scissors is Rick Flair. Nightmare move by Flair, but right back into scissors, Kevin Von Erich. Tremendous leg strength by the challenger from Denton County, Texas. Kerry Von Erich, who is in the National Tournament of Japan, twice challenging Rick Flair. And Flair, of course, as you see, still holds that world championship belt. Watch this move by Kevin Von Erich setting up. And Flair comes back down, still caught in the head scissors, and Kevin Von Erich. Really applying some pressure here, the screams of anguish from Ric Flair. And while Kevin holds that head scissor, let me tell you about some new and exciting spectacular wrestlers. Coming to World Class Championship Wrestling, Chavo Guerrero, a famous name in Mexican wrestling family. And a British Empire challenger for a championship, Chris Adams. Now Rick Flair is out of the head center. Kevin Von Erich. Former outstanding amateur in Denton County. A great football player in high school and at his University of North Texas State. And one of the most 
premier of all young wrestlers in the professional ranks today. Rick Flair and Kevin Von Erich testing the strength right now. Good move inside by Kevin. Hold him up. Now this sort of traffic can underneath. Good hook. Great move by Kevin Von Erich. He got caught in that arm drag himself, but he turned it around and put Ric Flair on the mat. Now Kevin maintaining control early in this bout. Here on World Class Championship Wrestling. Twisting wrist lock, but look at Kevin roll out of that. Drop kick off the floor, great move. Flying head scissors. That's what makes Kevin so spectacular, his ability. His great strength, his body control. Working that head scissors. Now, uh, Ric Flair has been rolled and pummeled and grasped by the tremendous tensile strength of the legs of Kevin Von Erich. Bronco Lewis, the referee now, trying to keep Ric Flair out of the way as Kevin was on the rope. And now Flair tries to get back and take charge. But Kevin won't let him. Up and over. Every move that Flair makes, Kevin counters it. Every move, Flair starts to turn it around and Kevin comes right back. And Kevin Leonard driving and driving. Now Flair, the blow to the midsection, that judo chop across the chest. Right in, right out, right back in. Kevin Von Erich ready to go. Tremendous body strength. Von Erich constantly working, maintaining their physique, their physical trim. And of course, Ric Flair. Certainly no slouch either. He's in good shape. Now the champion has tried a number of things. He comes up with a blow to the midsection. Five minutes gone in this bout. Another judo chop. Crash across the neck. Flying hit there and flare down. Smash with that fist. Looked like it got him right in the nose and the mouth. Kevin, I think, said his nose was broken. And a knuckle right down across the face of Kevin Von Erich. A flare setting him up. Another flying head there. And Rick Flair dropping knee across the top of the head. A flare now is taking charge. One, two, but not enough for three. Kevin bounces. Frame into this battle with great exuberance. Control the first five minutes, and now Flair has taken charge. One. But right back into the head center very quickly. Flair rolls back on top. And Flair. Kevin and each caught in their own headlock right now. Yeah, Kevin works the ropes. I'll go with the referee to separate him. And it goes toe to toe. It's heating up now. It's a brawl now. And if Kevin gets a chance, he'll put it up. Look at that move. Flair wraps up into the post. What a tremendous move by Kevin on earth. Tossing Flair at the right spot. And Kevin puts a claw on Flair, but that'll probably be broken because they're in the corner. Kevin brings him out. 
Kevin in the center of the ring with the iron claw on the head of Ric Flair. And the champion in dire straits now. But he breaks it with a blow to the midsection. Oh, Kevin Von Erich. Again, maintaining his supremacy in the belt. And now it's even up for a moment. Chop for the ribs. And Flair comes up for that judo side chop. Gonna try a suplex. Up and through. Kevin rolls it around into a sleeper. Kevin rolls it into a sleep hole. Kevin Von Erich. They put Flair down with this one. David Von Erich perfected this. Kevin is working it well. Flair trying to roll it off, but he does. And now Kevin has a problem. His eyes straight by Ric Flair. There goes back. A chop across the neck. Comes off for that blow. Now Flair trying to maintain control that he had a moment ago. And they both collide with a tremendous shoulder butt. This might do it. One, two. No, Kevin flails away. Now we'll see what Flair can come up with here as he goes to the top rope. And Kevin's got it. Oh, flying body slam for the top rope. The tremendous agility of Kevin Von Erich. Kevin works, works. Flying body slam again. One, two, but not quite enough. And Kevin has the referee down in his face. Looks like Brock Golovich might have got a blow to the head. Flair landing on the back of the referee, and Brock Golovich is maybe worse shape than anybody. Up over the top rope. That, that might, uh, well, Brock Golovich is down on the far side. Flair tossing Kevin over the top rope. Now into the corner post. See where Lubitsch is over the far side as Kevin hits the deck. Rocco Lubitsch in serious difficulty. And Lubitsch had his shoulder hurt. Kevin landed on him, then Flair landed on him. And Lubitsch had no way of knowing that Rick Flair set Kevin Von Erich flying over the top rope. And now the count is off. But Rick Flair certainly has control. He is really working. Kevin Von Erich fighting back, trying to get back in his mouth. Ten, Ten minutes, minutes gone. Flair hits the deck and a tremendous right hand by Kevin Von Erich. Kevin battering away, battering away. Into the midsection. Kevin Von Erich coming back after almost being out of this one. And Kevin has regained his second win. That right hand didn't have a lot of steam in. And Brock Golovich caught again, rolls out down to the floor. Kevin Von Erich dashing into Brock Golovich for the second time in this bout, and Lubitsch is out on the floor. Pounding away on the head of Kevin Von Erich. And there's the claw of the midsection. The abdominal claw applied by Kevin Von Erich. And once again, Flair rips across the eye. And there goes Flair over the top rope. Rick Flair over the top rope. Here comes Flair in. Well, now that would disqualify each of them. One apiece. There he goes out on the other side. So Kevin Von Erich. Now David Manning is down. That's David Manning at ringside. Flair into the corner post. Rocco Lubitsch shake it up, and we'll see what this situation is going to be now. Is David Manning has come in to 
Take over for the edge of Rocco Lewis. Well, both these men have been sitting together over the top rope enough to be totally out of it, but the referees were injured. Evan Von Eric. Rocco Lubitsch still out on the deck. And look at the blood on Rick Flair's head. Here comes Garrett. Fly body slam on Thomas Flair. One, two, and three. Kevin Von Eric has won the World Heavyweight Championship. Kevin Von Eric has upset Rick Flair at the State Fair Coliseum in Texas. And Kevin is overcome with emotion. It is a strange bout. A strange bout in that Flair, there's David Von Eric. Flair threw Kevin over the top rope. Then Kevin came back and threw Flair over the rope twice. But both times, Rocco Lewis was out. And now the discussion seems to be one of a serious note as Kevin Von Erich has won the heavyweight championship. David Manning talking to Kevin Von Erich if I can read lips. Oh! Rick Flair is still the champion. Rocco Lumic was out of the ring. He undoubtedly saw what happened. And let's look at it now in slow motion. Kevin Von Erich making that flying body slam into Ric Flair. And this was the finish. This was the moment. One, two, three, but Ric Flair is still the champion. And so, Flair won it, lost it, all in the same evening, got it back. Rocco Lovich in the midst of one of the most tremendous struggles Kevin Von Erich, a very, very disappointed young man, his brother David with him. Kevin Von Erich, like his brother Kerry, so close, in fact, maybe even closer, in having that championship. And we shall be back with more of World Class Championship.